Thank you. Beautiful song. How many albums have you done in English? In English, three. 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 Now, what makes this one better than the others or different? <laughs> it's the first time I understand what I'm talking about. <laughs> Oh, that's <laughs> no, that's not true. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys, the first time I couldn't understand anything, it was like uh, phonetically. And now when I go back to this album, I, I think, oh, after 12 years, you learn a little English. And it looks like, a, it doesn't sound like Chinese before. Before it was like a Chinese album. And I was, it's okay. I, I'm proud of this album. I'm very proud of this album. I like your tie. Thank you. Thank I, you very I, much. That's a nice tie. I appreciate the one you sent me over. You sent me, everybody knows I'm in the ties. He sent me a, a great tie, and I'm going on a date tonight. I'm going to wear it. Are you on a date today? Uh, yeah, I'm going, I'm going on a date, and I'm going to wear that tie because if anybody knows how to please a woman, it's you. So I'm going to wear the tie no, you no, sent me. No. <laughs> I mean, you have a reputation. I read someplace that you said you had been with 3,000 women? That was in 83. Why are you thinking that I can be with 3,000 women? <laughs> A guy who has been in the studio for the last 25 years. Impossible. And you know in the studio you cannot make love in the studio. Too much machine, too much life. <laughs> so who told you that I been with 3,000 women. Well, actually, I read it once, and I heard you, you proposed, Stallone was here last night. Yeah. And apparently you proposed to his mom, and she turned you down once. Now, I don't even know if that's true. You, that's why you're here, to dispel well, the rumors. I swear to me, I didn't understand very much. Did the you mother of Stallone? Yeah. Did you said? propose to the mother of Stallone? <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't think she will accept me. I don't think, I, I don't think with the reputation I had through the papers, I don't think she will say, yes, will you? But, it was very funny because yesterday my mother was watching you and the mm -hmm. together mm -hmm. and she called me at night because you know she knew I was going to do the show tonight and she said to me I like a Stallone so I think my mother will have a very good day with the Stallone that will be a good one but I don't think that the mother of Stallone will, will like me very much I like her anyway you, you've met her I met her yes and I like her I think she's a very strong women and very, well, he has a great, great son, which is Sylvester, which is wonderful. And I see also the little boy, which is yeah. wonderful. I see everybody last night. Yeah. I but, didn't see you. But uh, you never asked her to marry you. She probably just said that. She was probably joking. What were you talking about? She said, she, she said on the show, she said that you asked her to marry you. You tried to pull my leg. <laughs> <laughs> you have a very Spanish name, I send you, you know? Yes. Yeah, okay. Yes, it's a weird name in this country, but... but I, I will marry her. I will marry her. <laughs> I will marry her. <laughs> no, uh, I'm, not, I'm not telling you you should or anything. I, I just... I know you're trying to put my leg. No. Now. <laughs> Even if my English is not very good, I, 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 I have to have fun tonight. Okay. okay. Whatever you say, it's okay. I will, I will marry her. <laughs> And she said in a show with some of them. Anyway, um, are your parents in show business? No, no, no. My, my family, no. My father is not in show business. My your mom family. is? No. She takes care of uh, everything, but not in show business. Mm -hmm. and, Why? And you, um, I'm just trying to find out a little bit more about you. Your dad? Uh, my dad? My dad is a surgeon. He's a gynecologist. Good surgeon. He's a wonderful surgeon. Why? Ah. <laughs> friends that need a good gynecologist. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm trying to find out more. No, uh, maybe that's where you developed your, your understanding of women. Uh, your dad. <laughs> he helps. <laughs> he helps. He helps. Yeah, this he helps. You know why? When I was very young, <laughs> everything helps, you know. But um, <laughs> when I was very young, I remember then, then all the ladies used to come to the house with a big but you know, tummy like this, and I used to ask my mother, why the ladies have such a big tummy? And she then never stopped saying that it was because they drink a lot of water. 
<laughs> I was really confused because I saw so many people drinking water in the house. <laughs> One day I went, I was in the time of the school, in the morning, very early in the morning, I went to the room, in the, which is in the end of the house, and I went to the door and I showed, and I discovered the truth. Since that day, I start to drink water every day. <laughs> no, that's fine. <laughs> I know you're joking. You have a good sense of humor. You have a good sense of humor. Um, what's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you during a performance? Could be tonight. <laughs> no, 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 no. Happens to me a very funny story. Then I, I know that you heard about that. I will tell because I never said that in public. I was performing in uh, in Atlantic City, and I was singing a song, and it was Raquel Welch and his husband, and it was Oscar de la Renta, and some people there, and my zipper opened. <laughs> and I saw Raquel Welch looking at me very here, and I said, what happens? And I started to look like this, and I saw them, oh, I was embarrassed. <laughs> and, uh, I said to her, don't worry, nothing happens anyway. And that's all. But it's a very embarrassed place and very yeah. embarrassed situation. But it was a good thing because at that time I'm very fan of Rankin Welch. <laughs> <laughs> You're pulling my leg. <laughs>